what's up guys welcome to trading with bots and uh, in this series of videos we'll be looking at a strategy called the ICT silver bullet so we'll be looking at a couple of things about this strategy so the first thing is uh, the setup for the strategy in this specific video we'll actually look at the entry rules the exit rules and uh, how to manage the trade and then in the next coming videos we'll also look at automating the strategy and then after that we'll look at uh, back testing the automated strategy and then finally we'll look at the best markets to trade this strategy so first things first uh, let's look at uh, the origin of the strategy and uh, this is creator of the strategy ICT uh, this is his channel his official channel and uh, to get information about the strategy simply went to this page and uh, searched for silver bullet and uh, once I did this three videos came up so this is the first one the ICT silver bullet the next one evolving ICT silver bullet and uh, lastly FBG silver bullet so this is the main video that we'll be focusing on because this is where he gives the rules for the strategy the second and that videos are just him uh, taking trades based off the strategy so this is the main video that uh, I have gotten the most of the information that uh, we'll be discussing in the next series of videos so now once that is out of the way let's look at the rules that he gave so the first rule is uh, the setup time there are three setup time there are three setup times in uh, this strategy the first one is the London Open between 3 and 4 a.m. The next one is the a.m. session between 10 and 11 a.m. And uh, finally the p.m. session between 2 and 3 p.m. So like he mentioned in the video, these times are New York, New York trading times. So we should convert this time from uh, New York to our broker times. Uh, the next thing is... Uh, in the examples that he showed he was trading in the five minute time frame but uh, i also saw an example where he traded in the one minute so we can also try that to see the results the next thing uh, is the targets that he used for the targets he mostly based them off these seven points that he has given them that he has given here for example uh, the daily high and low and uh, the, uh, the previous session uh, highs and lows etc etc so the next thing is uh, the entry so the entries that he used were inside a fair value gap and then uh, he would place the targets after the liquidity zone and uh, the stops before the, pre the before the fair value gap so just to see examples of uh, the trades that he placed so this is one of them here uh, so you can first of all look at the time so here you can see that this is an AM session trade because it's between 10 and 11 AM. This is his fair value gap here. Uh, he placed his stop loss above the fair value gap. His entry was inside the fair value gap and uh, his target was after this current, current new week opening gap here. So the, his target was below that. So that is the first trade. Another trade that you can look at, uh, here we have a fair value gap and uh, the stop loss is faint but it's just above the fair value gap here and then uh, his target is below this sell side liquidity. So his target is several pips away from, uh, from the liquidity zone here. So those are just two examples of uh, trades that he took in uh, the videos that I just showed you. So this is what we'll be trying to automate and uh, once I automate it then I'll backtest it and uh, we can look at the results. So if this is something that interests you and uh, you'd like to see the results, you'd like to see whether this is a good strategy, then uh, stick around, uh, press the bell icon so that you cannot miss the video, uh, like this video so that I can know you're interested and I'll uh, see you in the next one.